Welcome to Cafe Neo, the first coffee shop chain in Lagos, Nigeria's bustling commercial capital. While Nigerians are famous for their eclectic cuisine, a culture of coffee drinking is somewhat new. Cafe Neo is hoping to change that. It offers vibrant colors, comfortable seating, and free Wi Fi to draw people, besides the cup of coffee. It was established by two brothers, Ngozi and Shijioke Dotsia, in 2011, but they've since opened two other coffee shops around the city. We actually made an investment in coffee in Rwanda initially, and in trying to sell more coffee in Nigeria, we actually discovered that there were no coffee houses here. So we tried to sell to the hotels, um, other hospitality joints, and when we saw that there was a market on opportunity, we actually decided to set up Cafe Neo. At about 900 naira, or four US dollars, for the cheapest cup of coffee, not everyone can afford to buy one. Cafe Neo caters to a niche market. Nigeria's growing middle class, who make up around 23% of the population and earn around $490 to $610 per month, according to the investment bank Renaissance Capital. The founders invested about $100,000 to start the coffee chain in Lagos, but it wasn't without hurdles. Currently, we get our coffee from Rwanda, but ultimately, we see you know the, the goal is it's an African brand, and we're going to be serving the best of African coffee: Ethiopia, Uganda, Kenya. We actually tried some Nigerian coffee um, about a month ago. It's actually fantastic coffee from um, Taraba State, the Mambila Plateau. It's more expensive because the, the logistics in bringing it here are actually more expensive than getting it from Rwanda, and this is another challenge that we face. I think it's different. I think it's, it's one of the things that is needed, especially in Lagos, in a place where you know, there's hustle and bustle and noise everywhere. You just want some places where there's calm, there's a certain type of community of people who come here, and great coffee. Cafe Neo plans to expand and open 30 new outlets in the next five years, placing them at the helm of a growing coffee culture in Nigeria. I like the fact that it's well, um, it's well placed, and from the out, from the outside, you can, it's, it's visible, and the color on the inside is really warm. It has that coffee feeling. Outside a few places like Ethiopia, which consumes more than half the coffee it produces, few sub-Saharan African markets have a taste for the drink. But with chains like Cafe Neo, things may be changing. Cafe Neo tells customers on its website that it is celebrating the return of coffee to its African roots one cup at a time. Maria Galang, CCTV.